Welcome to part 50 of Tales of the Abyss. Oh my god, 50 parts. Happy 50. <laughs> I mean, I'm expecting this to be a long LP, but... Eh. It feels like we just started this. Celebrate it really does. Times. Come on. <laughs> no, I mean, I know that sounds corny and all, but it really does feel like we just started doing this. I know that's not true because there's been a lot of times where we were, had a lot of breaks in between. I can't say for sure if we're halfway through the game yet or not. I doubt it. By the way, by the way, uh, yeah. past you. Uh, use, if you use uh, if you use Luke's forward forward attack, that it'll hit them. It'll hit the small buzzers on the ground easier. Yeah, the, the normal yeah. one won't actually hit them for some reason. Yeah, Fl fighting flying enemies in Tales games is always frustrating. I don't know who that's for. <laughs> like, where did you come from? Like, I've been standing here literally the entire time you have. <laughs> But for some reason, I just decided to just stand there for a few <laughs> seconds. I don't know I just know noticed why. this hurt animation. <laughs> <laughs> it's Astro one of Astro's rejected family members. <laughs> God dang it. <laughs> so many Arab guys. <laughs> I know, and they just keep coming. Suddenly the wind spirit. You're dead. Well, this suddenly went... This Kind of turned racist and went back to normal. <laughs> yeah, true. It did go racist, didn't it? <laughs> Sorry. A little bit. I'm not racist, I swear. <laughs> we aren't. The closest one to being a logic. racist in our group is Advanced Logic, and he flat out and he flat out admits he is. Well, uh, joking. He's not really racist. I was he just say, makes fun of people. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I mean, he said it in his own videos. That Mexicans are the most racist people, especially to other Mexicans. The only thing worse is... <laughs> According well, to him, anyway. Ah, uh, giant snake invading Chesedonia. I know, right? That, that happens to me a lot. It's like, hey, there's the place I need to... God no, I'm dang it. No, I'm saying the enemy looked really huge in comparison to the, how Chesedonia is. <laughs> well, everything looks big in comparison to... The, Towns and, uh, giant, I mean, uh, giant steak monster. Okay. I mean, do I need to? Do I need to remind you of that one scene when Noel drops us off at uh at Grand Kokma and it's like twice or er, not Grand Kokma. Um, no, it's in Gave. Yeah, when Noel drops us off and in Gave and like. Our character sprites are twice the size of the town sprite. <laughs> Good work, Noel. Like I know the world map shrinks everything down to scale, but jeez. <laughs> it's like suddenly we're in Attack on Titan or something, and everything's 500 times bigger than everything else. <laughs> Noel, you run like a wuss. Something's bothering. I'd like to fly through the cliff off a little. I'm not even going to touch that. <laughs> What's wrong? What? I'm being serious. I'd rather not say until I'm I saying. know, I know. Jade, Whenever Jade, don't be this way. That, something bad happens. Uh, he'll say it immediately as soon as we get out of here. Okay, let's get airborne. Yeah, something's like we got to figure out what's wrong. Like, what do you mean what's wrong? I'm not going to tell you until we get out of the cliff off. God damn Hello, it. Hello, Ant Lion Man. Hello. Are you actually going to have something good for us? Hello. You want the panacea you. bottle? And I, I gave you one already. <laughs> Thinking about Ash, why should we care about him? <laughs> well, he has been helping us. <laughs> he looks so time. serious. Tell me, Ake. The runs. <laughs> <It's> <laughs> dang it. <laughs> I think guys got the runs after look at the being next to the Italian the entire time. <laughs> <laughs> In the JRPG, nobody ever uses the bathroom in these things. I don't think there is a bathroom at all in these games. <laughs> oh, there is, just when we're off screen. Actually, now that I think about it, I think some houses in Zillia actually do have a bathroom. <laughs> in Zillia or Zillia? Yeah, I think they do too, but you can't, you can't really <laughs> They're just use there. them for anything. <laughs> <laughs> They're just there for decoration, just in case you're curious. 
You just have to imply that they use the restroom whenever you're off, whenever you're like traveling. Maybe there's a bathroom on the LBR, I don't know. It's a port potty. <laughs> I don't know, airplanes have restrooms. I don't think, the, when building the LBR, I don't think restrooms were on their minds. Does it like when Dr. Briefs remade Goku's spaceship and you didn't have time to put the cappuccino machine in there? But you've had time to put in a muffin bun. No, he didn't. He never installed a muffin button. It just existed. Well, now he has one. I never oh, installed I a muffin oh, button. Oh, oh. Where did I get... Then where did I get this muffin? <laughs> now, Frieza's spaceship had a muffin button. Uh, this is the, this is the part where I got ticked off, kind of. Why? Uh, when we go back to it, you'll see. Oh, oh yeah. This is just, they're just, <laughs> they're just I think being I know stupid what you're talking now. About. <laughs> well, I'm trying not to spoil things before we're it happens. We're just there. <laughs> no, I know. That's why I'm not. Tr that's why I'm trying to not <laughs> say anything about it. No, actually, what I think I'm doing right now is that like, you can't... There are new things you can buy here, but now because of all the stuff that's going on, uh, there's massive inflation. As in, everything's twice as expensive as it was the last Except time you were here for some reason. Yeah. Because that's the only thing that's important right now. <laughs> but if you were to go and try and buy weapons... They're still the same weapons that you bought the first time you were here, but they're like 10,000 gold now instead of 500. And these Border Patrol guys are still here. <laughs> well, that's their job. They just stand the, here. the world kind of uh, the, the entire pla the entire land just uh, you know fell into the fell into the planet. I think your job is done at this point. Also, this is the tedious thing about now that the now that this place is in the cliff off, you kind of have to, like I kind of forgot this when I was doing some of the side quests here, but you have to use that room. You have to use that building to get to the yeah. other side now. And now you can finally talk to the coachman that had Tears Pendant. So yay, we're gonna get Tears Pendant uh, back. We talked to him earlier. We did. Way way uh, earlier, but we, we have to have talk to him talk again to... apparently. Yeah. Yes, we did. Because uh, he shows up here now, you can ask him about Tears Pendant, because we still haven't gotten it back since when we kind of warped out to Let's Walkers. look for this race person. <laughs> race person. Yeah, so this guy's a dick, and he sold her pendant to another person, so now we have to <laughs> go talk to Ray. We have to talk to him, he said he sold it to another person, so we have to go talk to another person. <laughs> yeah. Trust me, you want to do this side quest? This is the most... Because you're. this is going to get you Tyr's best accessory in the entire game. I am not lying. Once you get this item, you will never need to unequip her. With the, You'll never need to unequip it. It's the best accessory Tyr gets in the entire game. Living proof. <laughs> oh, you'll see it in this part. <laughs> I'm going to get it in this episode. Yeah, we have living... I am living proof that the thing is best... Is the best equipment, because... Um, as of this recording, uh, my tier has phonic attack of 1,004. Nice. I mean, at this point, Jade has the highest phonic attack, but once you get this, once you get this pendant that changes, for tier, that changes. Nobody is stronger than her phonic attack wise. Nobody. <laughs> Which is kind of sad for Jade because he kind of only has phonic attack. <laughs> I think she meant I think it, the phonic attack's only used for healing anyway, so at least for tear anyway. Yeah. I mean she has other magic art she has phonic arts. She just doesn't have them yet. Hmm. Uh, for right now though, we can't like we are gonna get the pendant in this video, but for now but we have to get yeah. out of the cliff off first. <laughs> Mew, you can't drive. He's not driving, he's just sitting there. I like to there. pretend I'm driving. What's wrong with that Sephiroth tree? There's not even a steering wheel in front of him. <laughs> I like to pretend I'm driving. It's shining one moment and fading the next. It's like a phone on lantern that's about to go out. Or, you know, it's like a freaking lighthouse. So the Sephiroth have gone out of control. Just like the warning Something. on the Why does everything have to run on magic in these <laughs> because universes? Because screw electricity. Out of control? 
Electricity is yes. magic. It's like Apparently. by the magic of science. <laughs> well, I don't know. Some games have technology. Other games have magic. Other games have ma some Tales games have science. Other Tales games have magi tech. Usually magi tech. I think from what I heard, Zestiria is mostly just magic. Period. Which is kind of a bummer. Yeah. Which I think is kind of. I think this. I think Zestiria is going back to like how some, uh, like how Fantasia well, even, was. Well, even Fanta where it well, kind of has magic tech, well, but not quite. Tech. No, ma like that was the whole point. That was the whole focal point of Fantasia was Magitech, uh, <laughs> which makes you wonder. Like, I think Fantasia came out after Final Fantasy VI. You'd think Square would you know, want to sue Namco for stealing their idea. <laughs> um, I'd have to look that up. <laughs> no, no, wait, 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 no, no, I'm wrong. Uh, Tales of Fantasia came out in 1995. Final Fantasy VI came out in 1997. Or 96, something like that. Roughly around the same time, though. <laughs> It'll be swallowed by the sea of mud, unless the liquid surface were to solidify. Long story short, Magitech is usually a thing in every I kind of like how it was using so funny. It was kind of like a magic versus technology thing going on with it. Well, it was it was a prequel to Fantasia, so it makes sense for Magitech to be a thing. <laughs> It's not nearly as prominent in fan in Symphonia, I, but it's I just there. Like, I don't know. I just like that thing myself. No, I like it. That is that is the biggest thing about Symphonia 2 that I'm kind of, that I am disappointed by is like the lack of it's magic. Screw it. Tech. Everything's run by magic. Even if it does, it may be privileged. Well, I mean, Tethia, like for the most part, the world's united and they both have equal mana, that's the whole and point. Uh, everything's but... <laughs> run by mana, which makes absolutely no sense. Well, you'd think that, you'd think that because the world has more mana that, you know, Magitech would be flourishing because they have more mana to base no, it off of. No, apparently all the scientists and sidebacker are about as intelligent as Patrick trying to, trying to remove paint off a dollar. Maybe people in Cybek aren't using Magitech. Why would they not use Magitech? <laughs> that was the entire point of that was the entire point of Cybek. Anyways, let's not go. Let's not get too sidetracked. We got a different yeah, tale game to talk about here. <laughs> yeah, the battlefield kind of fell, and everyone that was fighting there is dead. They probably don't care Nobody's about the dead. war Nobody's right dead. now. Dead. Well. They're either dead or severely Agent injured. Themselves. Well, I mean, the people on the battlefield that fell into the cliff off when yeah, the that's battlefield what I'm talking exploded. About. Most people just fell, most people aren't hurt by yeah. the by the fall itself. Yeah. <laughs> You're just like nobody's gonna be thinking about a war right now. Moe's will. Well, Moe's yeah, will. Yeah, but... Moe's will. <laughs> what about Moe's? <laughs> Nobody cares. Hey, no, we don't care about Moe's right now. Look, seriously, the only person that cares about this war anymore at this point is Moe's, only because he's a douchebag. I want my prophecy to come true, dang it. It's not your prophecy, it's somebody else's. I don't care, it's just, the church says it'll happen, it'll frickin' happen, <laughs> god dang it. Moe's 2017. <laughs> it's, like, it's basically a Donald Trump campaign. Oh, god, no. <laughs> god, Moe's... <laughs> it, 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 but basically, it would turn into the Donald Trump campaign where both sides don't like him. <laughs> Actually, I'm pretty sure Donald Trump would would be okay with Moe's and be like, "Oh no, that's a good idea." Here's a good. That's a good <laughs> idea. BFF, don't you know? <laughs> this omnipotent like piece this. of paper tells us the future. <laughs> Let's listen to it. <laughs> There's a war. There's going to be a war. Well, we're, well, obviously it's going to happen because it said in the future it's going to happen. <laughs> <laughs> and there's Donald like, Trump's entire campaign. In why me? Because in the future I'll do something right. <laughs> Eventually, <laughs> it worked for Bush and it worked work. for me. Anyway, let's not get into a real political debate here. <laughs> <laughs> Who said this was a real debate? Nobody likes Trump. Well, at least seriously. Nobody around me. Not around, not around you me. You shouldn't anyway. like him. He's a moron. 
Duh, I follow like, He's like, I'm, <laughs> I can use big words, and I know, I do know what I'm talking about, but I don't know how to actually do it. My stance is, throw money at it, it'll work. Isn't that what we've been doing as a country for like 50 years, and that's the reason why we owe people a shit ton of it? <laughs> Anyway. Oh no. You're not doing this you're uh, not doing this side quest, are you? What side quest are you referring to? Just say it. I no, I'm know. not doing a specific side quest. At, th at this point I'm just going around finding search points just for the sake of finding them. Are you sure about that? Well, there is one side quest. Yeah, th well there is one and it's the most frustrating in the entire freaking game. That you can technically do right now. At this point, it kind of makes you wonder. You can do it right now and it get it really over the, with. But, eh. Saves you yeah, so, saves you you so much well pain from doing it, it later. It's, it's yeah, flavor text, it's I'm sorry, bad. but, eh. I know, how, I know what I'm doing, and it'll be over fast. He said he says he knows what he's doing. No, what I'm as he's no, over I'm not doing order. that side quest yet. Right now, I'm looking for search points. <laughs> no, I really am. <laughs> sure, you are. <laughs> I know, I know. No, you want to be? No, so is Trump. That's what. You see, that's the whole last thing about Trump. That's this whole. That's his whole thing. This whole his whole campaign is literally a joke. He's gonna. He wants to see how far he can take this joke. Like, can how I many actually people get into can I actually make him think I'm actually running for president? To the point where I don't have to do anything and people will vote for me because <laughs> I say I'm running. And I don't have to do a thing. <laughs> can I BS my way to the White House? to be what he's White trying House. to do. <laughs> I would rather vote seem to be Stephen working. Colbert than him. <laughs> Well, I'd I'd like, if, there to be a, if there then has again, to be so a joke else. candidate, I would vote for Stephen Colbert, because at least he wouldn't be taking this too seriously. <laughs> please, tell me you saw, please tell me you saw his of course I did. of this Donald Trump campaign ad. <laughs> that was of course good. I that was saw fantastic. that. <laughs> <laughs> the, 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 I love Stephen bear. Colbert, he's hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> the majestic bear. Yeah, I found that. You can't the hard fly across. <laughs> I'm like, wait a sec. How far into it before the sandstorm? Oh, first... damn it! You can't fly past through Chesapeake. Well, you can fly next to reason. it, but you can't fly through sand. And the issue is, like, the freaking hit detection for this is really big. That doesn't make. S Apparently a sandstorm can can go right no, over like, the mountain. Once you get over the mountain, that's where the sandstorm is. So if you, so if even a slight pixel of the albior goes over the top of that mountain and hits it, you're like ugh, I don't want to spend another five seconds looking at that text box game. Yeah, there's sand all over the windshield. Oh, well, what are you doing? You told me to go this way. <laughs> Don't yell it! <laughs> don't make me turn this thing around. Yep, that's <laughs> Yulia City. I don't want Yulia City. I think what I'm, tr I think I'm trying to get out of here now, and I'm not. You're trying to get out of yeah. here because you can't see because like, you have I the map off. <laughs> I know the exit to the cliff off is next to Yulia City, but I can't see it very well. It's right. I'm pretty sure it's right. I think it's right beside it's you. Map. Flying around Not at really the speed, speed of sound. <laughs> flying around at That's the better. speed there of sound. There we go. Yep. Yeah. And we're back Yay. in the and we're back in the hour land. Because we pretty much done, like there are side quests you can still do in the cliff off. But for the sake of my sanity, because I really like Doing a pure 100% run of this game would take forever. If I did every single side quest, we'd be here for like a year. <laughs> Even with recording like half hour parts. So many songs. 
so many, so many. And most so many of them are just so little time. And most of them don't even matter. Most of them are just like flavor text. <laughs> flavor, yeah. I mean, getting the search points is 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 useful if you want to like use Din's shop. Yeah. Although, technically, I'm not really using Din's shop in this playthrough. I'm just getting all this... I it's completely optional. Like I, like I said before, it's kind of like the customization shops in Zillia. Except worse, because you don't really know exactly what you're making. Unless you use a guide. <laughs> Again, the later games get that fixed by going, like, instead of just guessing, like, okay, what is this capacity core going to give me? Well, I'll find out after I after I learn it. <laughs> Zillia is going to be like, if you equip these, you will learn these skills eventually. If you give me these items, I will give you this. <laughs> Let's trade it, yeah. Let's Granted, trade. I didn't use the trade shops very much in Zillia either, but <laughs> they at least weren't, they at least weren't a crapshoot. Meh. They at least told me what I was getting. <laughs> Anyways, uh, now I'm trying to remember exactly what I'm doing at this point. I'm trying to sing, <laughs> but I'm singing really badly. Alright, I'm giving somebody this... Yeah. So like much I snow. don't have money. I need money. <laughs> Just sell the demon I do you sell got. it eventually. At this point, I didn't realize I still had it. <laughs> oh, that's it. Oh, what's this piece of Like, oh, here's that item that equipment. basically makes dark bottles useless, which doesn't matter because I don't run away from enemies anyway. There we go. I don't remember how they explain. Like, they don't really tell you which way to go. You just kind of have to go f keep flying until this cutscene happens. I hope the passage ring worked and the soldiers are safe. Actually, um, in the, I think in the 3DS version, it happens just as you yeah. as, as you exit out. Probably because they realized, oh, like as soon as you get out. Yeah, I think that's one thing that actually fixed in the 3DS version, is that as soon as you get out of the cliff off and you fly around like a couple meters away, well, then the Well, to be fair, the cutscene is going to warp us to a town, so I guess they were waiting for you to get close to said town before they warped you. <laughs> oh, I thought it did. It doesn't warp you. Yeah, <laughs> It just warps you yeah. back to where you were. I don't know why that is. Also, part of this world, also part of the world map is now frozen for some reason. Oh no, it's not frozen, that's the area that fell. It's not frozen. Never mind. Yeah, I like how yeah. I like how the world map like there's a huge spot where Casadonia used to be. <laughs> it's like it was never here at all. Although, like I, I get like Casadonia is an entire country that fell underground, but why isn't there like a well? No, there's a giant hole where X area used to be. I guess that's close enough. <laughs> <laughs> Chance it don't even no go down hole, the hole. Just fell underground. <laughs> I'm surprised nobody died. Uh, Lars, I don't get this. It's just a hole. <laughs> I don't think it goes anywhere. No, it definitely doesn't go anywhere. <laughs> it gets sh just shoved in. Ah! Oh, oh God! <laughs> oh, it's everywhere. Ah, <laughs> uh, Grand Kokma. I love this. I love this city. <laughs> <laughs> thinking about that now. <laughs> it's, just, it's, some, it's like one guy just looking down. Uh, I don't get this. It's just a what, hole. What are you quoting? <laughs> I don't think it goes anywhere. <laughs> just. Oh yeah. <laughs> Damn it. They um. Oh yeah. One episode where they go down south. I don't think it goes anywhere. <laughs> no, it definitely doesn't go anywhere. <laughs> and the porta potty gets shoved on the side. Oh, oh god. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh, it's everywhere. Okay, sell that. <laughs> there we go. Oh, it's in my record. There we go. Yay! I have money again. I should sell other crap, like all those ribbons that I don't need. 
Or wait, that strange mark that I don't need. Oh wait, no, actually I do need that strange mark. What am I doing? You don't need it's a strange use mark. It's kind of useful. You don't need a strange. You don't need a strange mark. Eh, you could. It's useful if you don't want to worry about casting time. <laughs> hmm. What? That's interesting. I could have swore the uh, demon seal was worth uh, even hundred thousand. Already sold 000. it. You weren't paying attention. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I probably wasn't. I thought I was looking back. I was, I was watching you sell stuff, and I, I thought the uh, the demon seal was worth. I think it was six thousand nine hundred. I think it's six thousand nine hundred ninety nine, like all these other things. Why is it that set price? The 3DS version has them as a has the has the uh, demon. Ma the demon I'm seal pretty sure the demon seal is a hundred thousand, but. Yeah, so I can't did, remember. Why it show up like that? I, what do yeah, I? Show I wasn't like paying that? too much attention to yeah. it, so oh well. Yeah. I'll look back on the part and then tell you. Can I have her pendant back? <laughs> and that's why I sold it because I realized, oh crap, I don't have enough money, and like, like hell, I'm gonna go and grind by fighting monsters. I can just sell all the crap I don't need. <laughs> hmm. Let me get. I'm gonna need a buddy of mine to tell you. The why price. should we have to buy it back? Because you originally sold no, we, it. We didn't sell it. We gave it to a coachman as payment for something. That counts but as But this selling. isn't the guy we gave it to. This is a different guy. Doesn't matter. Still counts as selling. Still counts as selling. I'm just saying. <laughs> in, this, in this case, I'm let's say. <laughs> Hmm, that's a that's a rather fancy pendant. Let me get let me get a buddy of mine that's good on pendants. Let me call Pawn Stars and see how much it's actually worth. <laughs> Luke. <laughs> what? I want to. Ow! Fine, fine. <laughs> Send it to me Send now. Guys are doing bitches with you. He walks away. He walks away with money in hand. <laughs> that mustache. <laughs> I'm gonna buy my own air. I'm gonna buy my own airship with cannons. <laughs> with blackjack. <laughs> okay. It's gonna be. It's gonna be so awesome. It's gonna be so awesome that. It's, it's gonna, gonna be so awesome that Ketterberg's gonna be jealous. It's gonna be so. It's gonna be. So, yeah. <laughs> everyone's gonna run. Everyone's gonna be riding the blackjack hovercraft. Yeah, <laughs> with my measly hundred thousand. <laughs> he goes over. To... <laughs> I'm gonna buy this entire casino. Hundred thousand. Ha! <laughs> Get out. <laughs> he loses it on the. He loses it on the casino. <laughs> <laughs> it's like he gets a hundred thousand and immediately goes. Put to it all on Pepper black. Hall. I got a feeling about that color. <laughs> <laughs> and fifty-two red. <laughs> Damn it! It's all white. <laughs> now I'm fifty-two broke, yeah. black. <laughs> what? I beg your pardon. Forty-three black. Yes, the rich get richer. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways. We have tears best with accessory. With that time, we have tears pendant. Look at that. 586 insert, to insert 703. 700 magic attack. You mix that with yeah. the genius wand, yeah, and this just makes it was, even more. Like, at this point, I'm going to give her the genius wand, because 900 phonic attack. That. Boom. Give me that. He has a lot of not as good. The sword <laughs> mace is just. Sorry, Annis. Uh, you are no longer needed as That's my magic joke. attacker. That's the joke. Well, she was at the she time. She had the highest. She had the highest phonic attack in the game up until now. <laughs> Why well, was she? The I said she could have been because she had the highest <laughs> phonic attack up. at the time. Now, now Tyr is, and nobody will catch up to her ever. <laughs> No, even I don't Jade think Blast. even Jade will catch up to her at this point. 
<laughs> Jake yeah. collapse. Oh, 900, that's cute. <laughs> 900 next cute. You have my 6,000 6, chronic attack. <laughs> uh, Jade, it still says... Four, it's like, uh, Jade, uh, it still says 400. I think it, <laughs> that's what you think. Next part. <laughs> Jade, it still says 400. Come closer and tell me what... You're going to say that Ow. again. Okay, still says... <laughs> <laughs> See you in the next part. <laughs>